Hey y'all, so today I'm doing a video and it is about colored eyeliner, specifically geared towards beginners. You know, sometimes you walk into Ulta or Sephora and you see all these different colors of eyeliner and you think, how in the world can I wear that? Or, you know, what do I wear it with? How do I even wear it at all? So that's why I wanted to make this video. Um, this is just a very neutral, simple look, but I'm telling y'all, this eyeshadow can be worn with any color liner. That's the beauty of this look. And also, you know, you don't have to do purple eyeliner. You can do any any eyeliner. There's so many different colors and so many different variations. There's pins, gels, liquids, stick. I mean, oh, the possibilities are endless. So, you know, if you want to learn how to do colored eyeliner, stay tuned and watch this video. Okay, so before I get into the eye tutorial, I just wanted to go over what makeup I'm already wearing. So, um, I'm just wearing like my normal foundation and I'm wearing my contour, my blush, and my highlight. And I just did them very light. I usually wear a darker blush, but today I just decided to go with something more pinky and that more blended in with my skin tone. And then, um, for my eyebrows, I just kind of did my normal thing. I'm not really into the super, um, like dark eyebrows like I used to do anymore. I really like just to kind of like fill in them naturally since they are growing a lot more. If you've been watching my videos since the beginning like it was like a year and a half ago when I started um my eyebrows were like little caterpillars and now I have like hair like there so I'm super excited about it so I just fill them in a little differently now and then um for my lips I'm just wearing Elf's Natural Nymph with a clear gloss over it and NYX's Nude Beige Lip Liner and um Basically what you want to do whenever you are picking out a lipstick to wear with your eyeliner You have to think about it The two main focal points of your face are going to be the eyeliner and the lipstick So that's why I chose a nude lipstick today because I'm doing a pastel purple eyeliner And I think pastel purple and nude look really good together um, Of course if you're getting festive, you know like for Christmas you can do the like green eyeliner red lips Or for fourth of July, I'm probably gonna do red lips and blue eyeliner, but just for everyday use you really want to just take your eyeliner and your lipstick and hold them up next to each other and think you know just do these two complement each other do they look good and that's how you can determine you know what you're going to do with the rest of your face with your lips and then also um for blush and everything you know you don't want to do something that is going to look weird with the lip and eyeliner combo anyways let's get into the eye tutorial so i'm going to be using the meat matte palette by the balm and i'm going to be using these three shades right here these um these shades are so pretty like i love them and i'm actually hitting pan on one of them because i use it so much um but honestly these three shades are perfect with any colored eyeliner um like um i said in the beginning of this video this look is something that you can wear with any color eyeliner so i've already primed my lids lids already whenever i put my concealer on i just take my beauty blender and i go up into the eye um i like it i get really really purple on my eyes so sometimes an eye primer just doesn't conceal it perfectly so I just like to take that concealer so everything just blends and looks like one and then whenever I am um, putting powder on my concealer I also do it on my lid too. Okay so I'm going to take this first color Matte Gallagher and I'm using Morphe brushes to apply these shadows and I'm going to blend this into my crease a little bit. Uh, I have hooded eyelids a little bit. You can kind of see how like my hood hangs over so I do my blending a little differently because if I do it like normally people do it, it just looks really weird. So, this is what I do. I'm going to take the shade Matt Smith and I'm just going to put that all over my eyelid. I'm just going to go back in with the first brush I used and just kind of blend it all in again. Now I'm going to take the shade Matt Ramirez. And then I'm just going to put it right next to where I started the lighter shade. Then 
I'm just gonna blend over it again with that first brush. Now I'm gonna go in with a definer brush and I'm just gonna take these two shades. I'm gonna start with the lighter one and I'm gonna go all the way in on my lower lash line and then I'm gonna take the darker one and go about halfway in. Now I'm going to take some MAC Nylon and I'm just going to hit the high points right below my brow and then in the inner corners of my eyelids. Now for the super fun part, I'm going to be using the NYX Vivid Bright Eyeliner and it is in the shade Vivid Blossom. It is a very, very, very pretty pastel color. Um, so whenever, if you're using the NYX Vivid Brights, which are, there's so many of them right now, they're super popular. Um, they're going to dry a little darker than when you put them on, so they're going to look super light and you have to let them dry because they are liquid and then they'll dry a little darker. And so I'm going to apply this the same way that I do just my normal liquid liner. I What I do first is I draw a line across my eyelid. Like I was just doing like a straight line of black eyeliner. And then I know a lot of people draw the bottom part of their wing first and then connect the top part. I actually draw the top part first and then connect the bottom part. I think that's the easiest way to get them even. So while it's drying, I just kind of want to talk to y'all about additional steps you can take from here. I am going to go straight into mascara. Um, you can definitely, like if you want to put on your bottom eyelashes or if you want to put another color on top, or like there's so many designs you can do, but just for like basic beginner eyeliner, I'm just going to go straight into mascara. If you choose to do false eyelashes, I would definitely recommend doing a black line across because the band of the eyelashes will not look correct if you just put it on top of colored eyeliner. Um, so of course that's just my recommendation. I am going to use their Real Mascara by Benefit on my top lashes and the NARS Audacious Mascara on my bottom lashes. This one is definitely a more pigmented black and then this one just really really makes my eyelashes look awesome. We scream and shout. Breathe in. Breathe out. We scream and shout. That is how you get this look. Um, I hope that you all learned something through this video, especially, you know, how to wear colored eyeliner just every day. Thank you all so much for watching, and if you like my video, you should subscribe, so that way you can be notified whenever I upload a new video.